Chivalries, we live, bitch. Ah, silly. What's up, y'all? My doggies just scratched the fuck out of my ankle. They're so happy. Say, like, you're so happy. You have to go pee. You have to go pee. Go pee. Ooh, it's nice outside, y'all. It is nice outside. Oh, I got mail. Oh, I hope it's my license. Eh, no, that's not it. Damn it. Good morning, y'all. You see my doggies? Bailey. Ellie. <laughs> Hi, my babies. Hurry up, go pee. It's nice, but it's cold as fuck. Good morning, y'all. How was y'all doing on this beautiful Saturday morning? Where is my license at? So I went and got a new license, right? And it still hasn't came yet. Like, they is doing the most. Like, I'm about to go on vacation. They better get their life and send me my stuff. Oh, because... I got to go. Like, I don't have time for them to be playing with me. <sighs> These dogs, they just be looking at. Could you please go pee? Go. No, 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 no. Go pee. She always trying to run in the house when I open the door. If you cold, you better pee. You better hurry up. Go pee. Hurry up. My dogs are so bougie. They don't want to do nothing unless you tell them to do it. I'm like, why do I got to tell you to pee? So this morning's vlog, I just have to clean. Ugh. My house is in shambles. It's not in shambles. I just cooked and didn't wash the pots. And then I got to start some laundry because laundry builds up fast. Oh, I can show y'all my new washer and dryer that I got. So I went to Amazon and got me a portable washer and dryer. Ew. It's cute. And I'm not taking my hair out my beanie because I ain't going nowhere. Girl, would you go pee? This one, she just, the puppy just want to play all the time. All she want to do is play. Well, now they going to get friendly because somebody walking down the street. Let's go. No, we're trying to get friendly, trying to get snatched. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, I'm trying to be somebody's friend. Like, girl. Let me get y'all. Let me get y'all some water. So yeah. Just gonna be cleaning today. And I gotta go get my nephew a birthday present when he gets when my husband gets off of work. Yeah, I'll see if Leonard want to be in a vlog today. He be, he he bougie. Here, hold on, I'm gonna get you some cold water. Here, but drink the, I mean, eat this food for now. Let me get you some cold water. Okay, y'all, I'm about to start this load. Let me first show y'all the washer and dryer. Um, Can I flip it? No, okay, hold on. So that is the dryer. It has three different settings, warm, hot, and air dry. It's 2.6 cubic feet. That right there is the, um, well, I guess I can pull it out and see if I gotta take some lint off. That's the lint catcher. Yeah, okay, so let me just, Take it out and clean it out. So I can start my next load. Okay. All right. So it's easy to put back. Just put that back on there like that. Flip it over. Put this other second lint catcher on there. And then put it back in there. But as you see, it's pretty big. It fits a lot of stuff. This is the washer. Um, and I still have it on like this little box because I bought these like rolly things, but that didn't work. I need to find a good one. The washer is 1.6 cubic feet. So 
so and it fits right up under there behind my right next to there but i gotta pull it out took it up to the sink i had to break my sink so i can fit the hose on there and put this uh attachment on there which i was kind of mad but i'm about to get the bathroom redone anyway so it's, i guess it's not that big of a deal um this is gonna be the first like two loads right here and then I had to like separate like the big stuff and do with two, three, like three different piles so so we can fit. My first load is always the most because I put like all the shirts, socks, and underwear because I can fit. I feel like I fit more stuff when I do it like that and then do the big stuff on its own. I got out there some king size sheets, a pile of towels and my work clothes and Leonard's jeans and sweats. And those are gonna fit in one load. So I, th I think I can get most of that in one load, but we'll see. So just make sure this is tight on here. And then I got my stand, so when I get ready to set it up, but that's just my go, that's my GoPro, not my GoPro. It's on there tight and it goes to here. That's on there tight. Oh, let me make sure I put this in the tub because last time my dumb ass left it out and my bathroom looked like the pool. I was already mad. I'm like, if I'm not, and it just puts in there. I did put this little thing on the end because of the lint. One day my tub had got clogged because there was so much lint in there and I was like, oh, maybe I should add something on the bottom. So yeah, I think the washer was 170. And the dryer was $250 because they had a, a, a cheaper dryer, but it um it didn't hold as much clothes. So I figured I'd rather I hold more clothes to dry so it get more room than to get a 1.6. It just didn't make sense. Um, okay, so let me open it. Oh well. Because that is in the way. I cannot wait till I get my bathroom done, y'all. Like I'm about to just be ooh. Get my bathroom redone and my bat and my kitchen. Hopefully, this guy comes. He's supposed to be coming to give me an estimate. Okay, so there's a lot of settings. So you can do soap for 55 minutes, rent, wash just a small load for 17 minutes, wash and rinse for 33, and just rinse and spin, or just spin. But I'm gonna do wash. So. I'm gonna do the water level high, and it's gonna run for 40 minutes. Turn on the hot water and the cold water. And let's know it's on good because it's not leaking. Then let me get my let me get my beads. Y'all, do y'all got these beads? Oh my god, they smell so freaking good. These beads smell amazing. They make your clothes smell so good. Let me start it. And she just fills up. That should be enough. And sprinkle my little beads in there. Get my soap. Which one I just bought? Okay, this is the one that's about to go. So let me finish this off. Oh, that's good. The beads smell so good. And I put, I don't put that much soap in here. I put it up to the two line. And that's it right there, that's empty. Is it empty? I got a little bit more in there. I'm gonna just top it off so I can, when I open up my new one. Put my little soap. Now I'll just start putting stuff in there. And it's probably, this whole basket probably going to fit because there's nothing but shirts and underwear and socks and shorts and stuff. So it might all fit. And you can see it's a lot of clothes. Oh. 
Let's see. Uh, I don't want to overdo it. So, as you see, it took most of it. Maybe this, like, towel and stuff can fit. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Oh, see, I know I told you. The whole basket was going to fit. No, that's going to be too much. Let me take these out. Because I want it to be able to move around in there. So, but it took most of the basket. It's just a couple of little things. So I put that with my second load. But for the most part, everything fit in there. So I'll just close it. Wait 40 minutes. And then the dryer, when this washer goes, I can plug in the dryer and seal the washer and dryer. I can still be able to keep washing. And it only take um, 40 minutes for the stuff to dry. So when I put the stuff in here in the dryer and I can have the, and I set the timer about time the washer is done after we loaded and everything, that load in there will be dry. Okay, so I'm gonna let that stuff wash and go clean up my kitchen and eat me some cereal. And then I'll be back when it's time for me to put the stuff in the dryer so y'all can see how the dryer works. And then, yeah, so, boom. Don't talk about my glasses. They broke. I know. I gotta. I be wearing my contacts, but when I'm in the house, I wear my glasses because I don't feel like messing with my eyes. Oh, I probably should get my glasses today, too. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see what time he gets home from work because usually he doesn't work on Saturdays, but... This, they job tried it, so we'll see. All right, I'll be back. Show y'all one of my gifts I got for Christmas. Like, <laughs> oh, I just love this gift, y'all. Just, oh, just look, just look. look. Where, like, cast iron skillet ish, just like deep. So, oh, you know how much, how much chicken the bitch got bacon is. Like the other day we made steaks and we had three big steaks in here. It was just, oh, just, mm. thank you, brother-in-law. You know, you did that, honey. Like, that is just one of my favorite presents from Christmas. Like, you know, I'm trying to get my little cooking skills up or whatever. And he come through with a big old cast iron skillet, you know. I'm trying to see if the meal run because I ain't, that meal I got earlier was from yesterday. I'm really like searching for my damn license. Like, where is it? Oh, I can't wait to finish. Oh, there she go. Ew. Hey, ma. Look at her. My mama fine, y'all. Oof. She the first person I see when I walk in the door and the first person I see when I walk out. I just love her. Look. Ew. Hey, sexy. I miss my mama, y'all. All right, these clothes should be done. Oh, I forgot I had this music on up here. What song playing? Ow. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's done. Okay, so let me flip the camera. Let me see how it spin down. So now we put them in here. Oh, they smell so good. Okay. I see there's still a lot of room in there. So I set it on 45 minutes. And there it is. It works. All right, guys. I am getting ready to end this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I'm kidding. I hate him. <laughs> I'm getting ready to cook. Well, we're getting ready to cook, but he don't want to be in the vlog. Say hi. No. Say hi. Oh, <laughs> he's saying bad languages, babe. Say hi. I'm going to cuss at you. I'm going to cut you, too. I ain't nobody's bitch. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Yes. Are you positive about that? Don't ever call me no bitch. I'm a grown man. Are you grown or you little? Both. 
Both? I love you. Don't get gay on you. Huh? Don't get gay on you. All right, guys. You guys have a good night. As always, love, peace, and hair grease. And I will see y'all next video.